midday on the web. Plans to ban the mosque minarets in Switzerland have sparked violent reactions online. The Tour de France moves on to the web. And the day's pick of the best. The right-wing nationalist party in Switzerland will officially launch a campaign today to ban mosque minarets in Switzerland. The web is divided. The creators of this bill have created this site to promote the idea. Web users are invited to download a pamphlet supporting the idea that minarets symbolize Muslims' desire to monopolize the politico-religious power. An argument supported by many, this web user has put results of a survey online proving that nearly 50% of Swiss people back the project. This blogger is revolted by these results and says they demonstrate Switzerland's withdrawal into itself and a rise in Islamophobia in the country. More proof of this trend lies in the multiplication of films on the web. Here a member of the extreme right exploits the fear of Islamism and insists strongly that Switzerland should remain a country of Christian tradition. Faced with these online campaigns bordering on xenophobic, many Swiss people are expressing their opposition to the extreme right, as these videos show. The 95th Tour de France began this weekend and will continue for three weeks and has moved onto the web for the occasion. The official website holds a wealth of information on the participating teams and cyclists. It also has a number of videos looking back over the daily stages as well as the history of the Tour de France. This French journalist has been inspired by the competition and decided to travel through each stage one day before the participants do to prove it is possible to complete without taking drugs. You can follow this initiative on his site. For many, the use of drugs remains the Achilles heel of cycle racing. Appeals for a clean Tour de France are multiplying on blogs and on Facebook, groups have been created against the use of drug taking. And finally, Google via Google Maps allows you to visit in three dimensions the towns which make up the 21 stages of this year's race. It's like a real trip through France and without leaving your office. Here is one of the most watched videos at the moment on the American web. The very conservative Republican, Newt Gingrich, reveals his three solutions to overcome rocketing fuel prices. He calls, for example, for the authorities to authorize drilling in the United States in protected areas. Many are disgusted by his propositions, but millions have signed the petition asking the authorities to adopt his controversial ideas. Nobody wants to share with you. Dresses buttoned up to the neck or simple cotton shirts, clothes from the Texan Mormon set to the Fundamentalist Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints are now available online and hundreds of Americans have let themselves be tempted by this old-fashioned style.